Hello YouTube, uh, this is going to be a brief uh, video, brief and messy video actually about using MSI Afterburner to uh, reduce your uh, electric bills a little bit while you're mining on uh, well, any mining software really but I'm using Nice Ash Miner as an example um, as I say it's going to be a little bit messy this video so uh, I've got Nice Ash Miner open there and you can see the current uh, hash rate on Equihash there and I've got MSI open here with the uh, you can see the temperature of the core there but they're all linked so as I alter one setting on this uh, dashboard here it'll alter the setting for all three cards so as long as you've got that set up in the settings mind you and all I'm going to alter is just the the uh, power limit there so I'm just going to click on it and then use the arrow keys on the keyboard to adjust it because it's you can find adjust it a bit better and then click on apply and I'll just do it in at first five degree increments for just a little while and um, perhaps twice and then start going down in one degree increments um, and you'll see this this temperature here slowly start to come down and what you want to keep an eye on is you don't want to affect your hash rate so you want to keep bringing that slider down and then waiting for a while make sure your hash rate isn't affected and then bring it bring the slider down once more another point or another five points if you're starting off and uh, and when that hash rate starts to become affected starts to drop that's where you want to stop and perhaps go back one point um, apply it again and, um, and keep an eye on your hash rate see if you get it back to normal and if it goes back to normal that's where you're about right for your uh, for your power limit and you're going to reduce your your, uh, your consumption by about uh, results are about 10 to 15 percent redu reduction in overall power consumption so uh, well, we're worth having really so yeah I hope that helps you guys